Do you think that'll get the water out? I really hope so, because Mom cannot be waiting a week for her medication. Yeah, you gotta draw it. It worked. Yay! Let's go bring it to Mom. Great. What? It's Stacy. The one who messed up your magic? Yeah, just let me handle her. What are you doing here? Just visiting a relative, but I'm kind of hungry. Draw me money. She can't draw you money. It doesn't- Oh, hey! My gosh, just draw me ten dollars. It's super easy. You know what? You're right. And that makes ten dollars I drew for you. There you go. Thank you for drawing me this, honey. And actually, I forgot my- Charger? Yeah, I know. Officer, I didn't know it was counterfeit. She shouldn't have used that money. <laughs> Let go of me! I just want to buy food! Please be green. Please be green. Transparent? Is that even a thing? Never mind. I'm not complaining. Is that my boyfriend over there with the girl? See ya, babe. And don't worry about her. I'll make sure she doesn't find out. Whoa! Babe, hey, how are you? Don't touch me. We're over. Aw, oh, come on. Why is my mom at my school? And why is she talking to my science teacher? Well, you know what they say in science. Opposites attract. <laughs> You're a good kisser. Mm -hmm. Would you mind if I invite your science teacher for dinner? No, not at all. Your mom sure makes the best food. Mom, shouldn't you call and check on Dad? Yes, I should see how he's doing on his trip. I'll call with you. We can't keep hiding this. Yeah, she's got to know I'm her real dad. How are you always at a one? She has no life. She's boring. <laughs> I am not. Hey, leave her alone. You guys are just jealous. Whatever. Thanks for that. No problem. Would you maybe want to go on a date? Yeah, um, pick me up at eight. Tonight? Oh, okay. Did he give you any intel on the target? No, he didn't know anything. Damn it. All right, get rid of him. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll find the target soon enough. Shit, I forgot about my date tonight. I can't go with this high of a wanted number. Hey, you gotta pay for those. There's no time, sir. I have to go walk my hamster. Wait a minute. Hey, kids, who wants some toys? Me, me I too. Do. You get a squishy. Yay. You get a squishy. Thank you. you. get a pop it. You get a squishy. Ow. Oh, be careful. You're at a two now, huh? Yeah, I went through a red light. <laughs> Wait, how are you at a four now? Oh, am I? Well, let's change that. All right, how much time do I have today? 30 minutes to get ready. I mean, I guess that's doable. Time starts now. Oh, crap. Time's up. Okay, I'm done. Whoa, what happened to you? I only had five minutes to get ready, and I tried to do a winged eyeliner. Big, Big mistake. mistake. I really need to use the restroom. 30 seconds? Oh, please, that's plenty of time. Time starts now. I gotta go. You may now begin your test. I only got three minutes. Time's up. No, I can't feel this. Yes, I finished. Stop right there. Let's see your hands. We're going to need you to come with us. What's going on? You're in violation of the time law. Five mil or a squishy panda? Is that even a question? Come on. Squishy panda all the way. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. I shall call him squishy and he shall be mine. He shall be my squishy. You chose that toy over the money? You know we're broke. But I just thought that... But I just thought that... No, you didn't think. You never do. You know, I wish you would just be nicer to me. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna go get you a Target gift card. Wait, what? <gasps> I think the squishy is magic. Could I borrow some money for food today? I'm so sorry. You know, you've always been such a good friend to me. I just wish I could give you a hundred dollars. Oh, wait. I can. What? H how did you? A little magic trick. Enjoy. Pop quiz today, class. Here's your quiz. I wish my classmates would break out into song. What? No, no singing. <laughs> it's not only when we were younger, you were mine. My boo. Please be a cool power. I really hope I get, like, super strength or something. You can see through everyone's what? What power did you get, honey? <gasps> my eyes. What's the matter, sweetheart? I think it's best if you don't know. Um, okay. Mr. Smith. Hey. Mr. Smith. I'm excited to see you and your family for dinner tonight. That was today? Yeah, your dad invited me over to watch the game, remember? You're not canceling on me, are you? No, sir. Okay, see you then. Take those glasses off. You're going to embarrass us. Oh, trust me. It is too late for that. 
All right, come on. Yeah, man, do I love football. <laughs> I'm going to go help my wife with the food. Be right back. Hey, I think I know what your power is. You do? Yeah, it's okay. I also got the same one. Well, you better turn around right now. Uh, why would I do that? Oh, oh, what was that for? I thought you had the power to see people's crushes. All right, here's your pay for this week. A dollar? Seriously? Sorry, but a nanny job isn't very dangerous. How was work? I quit. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, all they paid me was one dollar for watching their kids all week. I think I'm going to become a lion tamer instead. I hear they get paid millions. Absolutely not. But mom... No dangerous jobs. Honey, the neighbors need someone to babysit their hamster. I am not doing that. Oh, yes, you are. Hi, my mom said you needed someone to babysit your hamster. Oh, yes. Come in, come in. I'll pay you $500. A day? An hour, actually. Do we have a deal? Yes. <laughs> Great. Don't feed Hammy after midnight. Why? Just don't do it, okay? <laughs> oh, you want some? Okay, here you go. Wait, what time is it? Uh-oh. Hammy? Give you that necklace for a reason, love. It's a trap. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? My soulmate controls my hand or my clothes. I've heard some weird stories about people who chose hands, so I'm going to go with clothes. Please pick me something good, Ed. A party dress? I have school today, so there's no way I'm wearing... This is some sort of joke, right? I'm not wearing this to school. Why isn't it coming off? You may not remove their outfit. Hey, guys, look at what this girl is wearing. Sweetie, prom's not till next month. <laughs> that is not school appropriate. Detention. But I didn't choose to wear this. My soulmate made me. Too bad. Excuse me, are you okay? I'm so mad at my soulmate. I can't take this outfit off, and I already got detention for it. And I'm freezing. Here, take my jacket. Thanks. What clothes would you want your soulmate to pick for you? I don't know, like jeans and a t-shirt. Today, I swear he better not... Those are the clothes that I told to that guy. Daddy, what is that? That's your likeness score. From now on, every time someone likes you, your score will go up. And when you reach 100%, you get to meet your soulmate. Wow. Snow, meet my new wife. Hi. Aw, hello. Daddy, I thought you said when people like me, my score will go up, not down. I don't think she likes me. Of course I do. There just must be a glitch. Ah, the king's passing was so unexpected. Princess, I brought you a rose for your loss. Thank you. It's lovely. Where is my rose? It was a loss for me as well. He was my husband. I'm so sorry. I was just thinking of the princess, your majesty. Snow? Yes? I just noticed your percentage has been going up a lot lately. And father said that when I reach 100%, I'll be able to meet my soulmate. Hmm, no. That won't happen. Why? Because, dear, it's not meant to be for you. In fact, follow me. Let me show you something. Here, you need to see this. A book? It's a magic book. Now open it and see why you can't meet your soulmate. Read the words. Magic book in my hand. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? The queen is the most liked. Her score is 80%. You see, dear, as queen I have a reputation to uphold. It was very hard for me to get to 80%, and I can't have you surpass me. But why can't we both reach 100%? No, it's either me or no one. From now on, you will no longer be allowed to leave this castle. But I promised the village kids that I would bring them toys today. So your likeness score can go up? I don't think so. I'm not going to break my promise. Thank you. And one for you. Thank you, princess. Wow, that was very kind of you, princess. Are those your guards? There she is. Get her. You have left the castle without permission, princess. I'm sorry. The queen orders you back now. Uh, don't hold her like that. Wait. My queen, we have found her. You directly disobeyed me. I'm sorry, I... Silence. Look at your score. I didn't mean for that to happen. Your percentage is higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. Mm. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. 
I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But... Run, now! <sighs> Hey, shoo! Get out of here! Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vines. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were... you? I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. I guess the likeness score works on animals, too. Now that I'm at 100%, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him. Mom, look, I can get a teddy bear or a paintbrush. I think I'm gonna go with teddy bear. <gasps> no, pick the paintbrush. But I said pick it. Okay. My paintbrush came in. Oh, thank goodness. There, that's for you. Now paint money. Money? Why money? Honey, just paint it. Okay. Okay, I'm done, but I don't understand why- Shh! Look! Your paintbrush is magic. No way. So you're telling me that everything I paint will come to life? Yes, the paintbrush only works for you. Well, I want to paint a puppy. Honey, no. Don't be selfish. You need to think of others before yourself, and there's lots of things that I need. Okay, here's your gold crown. Oh, it's perfect. Mom, can you please make me some food? All this painting is making me really hungry. Why, of course. But don't draw anything while I'm cooking. I'm going to paint something she would never let me have. My own boyfriend. Honey, dinners. Let me see that. Now that I reached 100%, that has to be my soulmate. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, hello, my dear. I hope I didn't scare you. Actually, I'm not supposed to have strangers. But wait, I'm here to give you your soulmate. In that case, come inside. I brought this for you. An apple? Yes, you must be hungry. I don't like apples. But dear, I sense you're very lonely ever since your parents passed away. How do you know that? Because I'm magic. Isn't that how you feel? Yes, I... I've been so lonely. This is why I'm here, to help you, dear. One bite of this apple will make your soulmate appear. Do you promise? Cross my heart. You'll never be lonely again. Isn't it just... Delicious. You're so gullible. <laughs> what did you paint? Nothing. I was just scribbling. Really? Then let me see it. No, wait. What is this? This is going in the garbage. Please, he wasn't done yet. He? Were you trying to draw a boyfriend? No. Give me that. No, this is my magic paintbrush. You can't just... Don't tell me what I can't do. I'm confiscating all of your paint stuff until tomorrow. Sorry, Mom, but I'm finishing this. The last thing I need is his eye color. I think this blue will look nice. He's done. Did you learn your lesson? Yeah, I did. Good. Here's your painting supplies back. Today, there is a lot I need you to paint for me. I finished your purple hair clips. Thank you, honey. Can I be done now? Hmm. I know you're not that tired. Well, it has been two hours, so okay, you rest. Mom, five more minutes. I'm not your mom. I'm your boyfriend. Princess, we're home. No, this is my fault, Dad. Son, it is. I should have never left her alone. You'll be a queen in heaven. Goodbye, Snow. Soulmate found. Zachary? Princess, you're... you're alive. True love's kiss. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what the queen did. This has gone too far, my dear. You must take back your kingdom. You're right. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? Princess Snow is the most liked. That's impossible. She's dead. Think again. Stepmother, you're under arrest. Guards, take her away. Get off of me! I'll be taking this. No! 
That belongs to me! That crown belongs to Snow now, and I gotta say, it really suits her. I'm your boyfriend. You look exactly like how I pictured you. Down to the hair color and everything. I can't believe this. I didn't even do the best job painting you, but you seem to have come out. Who is this? That's the delivery man. Delivery man? I didn't order anything. Excuse me. I'm her boyfriend. What? You disobeyed me. Mom, I have been painting so much stuff for you, and all I ask for is just one boyfriend. Please. Do you have my hair clips? Yeah, they're right here. What are you doing? Testing a theory. <sighs> if I rip his painting, he disappears. Look, I found it. Stop. <sighs> Mom, let go. Please, you're hurting him. Oh, that's the point. No! It's okay. Hey, catch. Don't give that to her. What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Getting you out of my life. You can't do that. Where did she go? I, uh, painted her on a tropical island, but don't worry. I'll make sure she's well taken care of. Get adopted by a race car driver or a billionaire? I'd be kind of scared something would happen to the race car driver, so I'm gonna go with billionaire. Who'd you pick to get adopted by? Oh, I chose a billionaire. You got that as an option? My choices were a garbage man or a teacher. That is so not fair. Whoever it is is gonna think she's weird anyways. She'll be brought back. This is the man who's gonna adopt you. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. First things first, you're gonna need some of these. What are these for? A lot of paparazzi follow Mr. Knight. I'm his assistant. Hi, I suggest you put those on now. Mr. Knight, is this your new daughter? This way, darling. Your house is really nice, sir. Oh, thank you. What's that? This is a list of things that I wanted to do with my new parents. Are you married? Actually, sorry, kid. No, I'm not married. That's okay. I'll just adjust some things. I don't know about this. People are loving that you adopted her, and as soon as they write enough good articles, we'll bring her back to the adoption center. Good morning. You look sad. Well, it's just that I can't find any of the clothes that I brought with me. Oh, darling, that's because I threw them away. What? Why would you- They were hideous. We can't have you wearing orphan clothes. But- Hush. Follow me. Oh, this is much better. But the dress is a little bit short. You're sixteen, not six. Now hand that thing over. No. What's going on in here? Mr. Knight, your assistant. She's trying to take away my plush. Susan? She needs to act her age. Please don't let her, Mr. Knight. This is really special to me. She's too old for it. It has to go. <gasps> no. Don't be so dramatic, dear. You'll be fine. Smile, Madeline. We're going to do a photo shoot. Smile bigger. Stop the cameras. That's enough pictures. Here, Madeline, look what I found. How about we do something on your list today? I saw you wrote down Disneyland. Want to do that? Okay. It's beautiful, isn't it? Psst, get here. Thank you. Madeline, we need to talk. Mr. Knight doesn't have time to be taking you places. He said that he had fun spending time with me, and that I can keep this. Oh, is that so? Don't make me send you back to that- Susan, I need your help. Coming, sir. What's next on the list today, kid? Are you sure you have time? Yeah, I need a little break from work anyways. Well, I always wanted to go to a science museum. All right, science museum it is. Susan, prepare a driver for us, please. Of course. Have a good time? Yes, it was so much fun. <laughs> it really was. I'm sorry if I'm too much of a distraction for you. Kid, you're not a distraction. In fact, I think you're exactly what I needed in my life. Okay, you rest now, and I'll see you in the morning. Good night. Sir, the paparazzi got you at the science museum today, and so many articles have been written- I don't care about the articles anymore. What? Shh, I'm not gonna use a kid to get me more publicity. The plan's off. But sir, guess I'll just have to get rid of you myself. And I know just what to do. I found someone from your real family. You did? Yes, dear, your Uncle Nick. I don't remember an Uncle Nick. He'll explain everything, darling. He's here. So you're her mom's brother? Yeah. How did you find me? You're all over the news. I know you probably don't recognize me. Your mom didn't really talk about me much, but I'd like to adopt you. I'm happy here with Mr. Knight. Madeline, don't be rude. At least give him a chance. I don't want to push anything, so how about you live with me for a week, and if you don't like it, I'll bring you right back here. Uh, okay. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Oh, perfect. You call me on this phone if you need anything, okay? I will. Thank you. Of course. Come here, kid. I bought you some candy. Susan tells me it's your favorite. Thanks. We'll be at my place soon. Is it good? Why do you have that stuffed animal? Oh, uh, one of my best friends from... 
foster care gave it to me. Taste everything my boyfriend eats, or feel every time he gets hurt. I'm kind of a picky eater, so I'd rather know when he's getting hurt. Power activated. Should I tell him that I have this power now? Nah, that's kind of weird. What? What's weird, babe? Nothing. Uh, alright, well, I'm headed to the store. Okay, be safe. Ow, what the heck? What did he do to his hand? You kind of took a while. Yeah, traffic. I'm sorry, babe. Why is your fist all red? Oh, that. Yeah, I scraped myself at Home Depot today, picking up some plywood. <laughs> I gotta go into work. What? I know it's a weekend, but they need me. Can't you just cancel? <sighs> Not this time, babe. I'm sorry. I'll be back. All right. Be safe. You know, I never really found out where he actually works. I think that he just got... You don't look so good. Are you feeling okay? No, not really. Hey, it's me. The candy worked. She's half out of it now. Excellent. All right, time to come inside. Come on. Finally, I can take this from her. So what do we do with her now? Well, she's already got Mr. Knight all the publicity he needs, so she's no longer of use to me. Susan, what's going on? Oh, Madeline, isn't it obvious? I'm getting you away from Mr. Knight. He's mine. Mr. Knight is going to find me. He's not going to look for you, because Susan's been telling him that you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, darling, but I need to be the focus of Mr. Knight's life, not you. <sighs> you know, I never really found out where he actually works. I think that he just got shot. Hey, it's me again. I'm really worried about you. Please, just call me back. Oh my god, babe, you're back. Are you okay? Yeah. Wait, why are you asking me that? Well, I've just been really worried about you because you haven't answered any of my calls and I had this feeling that you- I'm fine, babe. Really. I just need a rest. Please. We've been together for a year, and I don't even know what his job is. I'm going to march right up there and ask him what- Ow! Did he just get hit in the head? Ah, oh, what is going on? I told you guys I quit! Babe! Is that guy- Don't worry, baby. He's just, uh, sleeping. There's something I have to tell you. I- I work for the Mafia. The what? I know, I know. It's bad. But today I quit, and I promise- oh. Ow! Wait, why'd you say out? Well, there's, uh, something that I need to tell you, too. Build my own pet or build my own soulmate? I'm pretty single right now, so I think I'm gonna go with soulmate. Pick a color. I like them both, but I am a sucker for blue eyes. Pick a hug. I mean, I want them to be tall, but not, like, too tall. Six foot is good. Pick his figure. Not that that's important, but, you know, a little muscle never hurt anyone. Okay, now this one is confusing me. Toxic or supportive? Yeah, I really want my man to be toxic. Come on. Creating your soulmate now. Okay, I am so nervous. Please stand by your soulmate is processing. All right. I have been waiting here for like two hours. What is the holdup? Unexpected error. Your soulmate has been delivered. Okay, that was uh, really weird. Okay, no big deal. Your soulmate is at that door, so just be cool. Be confident. Here we go. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Everything's fine, sir. I want to talk to her. Ah, uh, sorry. She just fell asleep. Thanks to this brat, Mr. Knight is getting suspicious. You're not going to get away with this. Mr. Knight is going to find me. <gasps> it's him. Stay calm. I will handle it. Mm, so I can assure you, everything is fine. Help! Wait, don't open that... Madeline? I'm sorry, sir, but you're supposed to be in love with me, not her. You're my assistant. But I wanted to be more than that. You're insane. Both of you, get back. Susan and your fake uncle have both been arrested. I thought I'd never see you again. I am so sorry this happened, Madeline. But I promise, as your father, I'll protect you from now on. Father? So you still want to adopt me? Aw, oh, kid, of course. I mean, after all, we've got that list to finish, right? And look what I found. I love you, Dad. Madeline, I... I love you, too. Let's see your mark. Purple? Purple equals famous. You're five and you still can't read. It says famous. Well, does that mean that I'm gonna be famous? 
You famous. Oh, no, honey. These marks are just for fun. But, um, you should cover yours up. Do you think I could use your house really quick to charge my phone? Yeah, sure. Wait, is that a blue mark? Sorry, can't help you. Please, I couldn't afford to pay my electricity bill this month, and all the public charging stations are for rich people. I missed the part where that's my problem. Get out of here. Hey, isn't that the girl whose parents, like, died at sea? Yeah. Yikes. They're not dead. They're gonna come back. Oh, really? Yeah. And when they do, they're gonna bring back the lost pirate's treasure. <laughs> my mark is gonna change. Well, be sure to call me when your zombie parents come back from the dead. <laughs> hey, don't listen to them. You're gonna be okay. It's easy for you to say that. Your whole family has yellow marks. Look, just because we're rich doesn't mean we're... Mail delivery. Kayla, what's that? It's a card, and it's signed by my parents saying that they want me to meet them at the Golden Ball. Sounds like a trap. No, I know my parents' handwriting. Only yellow marks can get into the ball. Well, then I'll just have to change my mark. Wait, what? You are so lucky I have yellow paint. So, uh, yeah, we just gotta trust the process on this. Dude, hurry up, I hear cops. I'm going as fast as I can. Well, then I'll just have to change my mark. Wait, what? You are so lucky I have yellow paint. So, uh, yeah, we just gotta trust the process on this. Dude, hurry up, I hear cops. I'm going as fast as I can. Hey, you two, let's see your marks. Huh, have you guys seen any blue marks? No, sir. No. Good, because they're not allowed around this side of town, so if you see any, let us know. Will do, yes. Let's go. That was close. What did your parents' letter say again? It said for me to meet them at the Golden Ball and to wait for a signal. Kayla, this really sounds like a trap. And you can't wear that to the ball. Look, you gotta dress like a yellow mark. You gotta wear a fancy dress. Well, I might have this mark, but I don't have money. But I do. Come on, we're going shopping. Come on, Kayla, you're about to have your Cinderella dress moment. Hey, you. Let me see your mark. Come here, let me see it closer. Uh, officer, is everything okay? Hey, you. Let me see your mark. Come here, let me see it closer. Uh, officer, is everything okay? There's been a lot of people faking their marks, and hers was- <laughs> You gotta be kidding me. Ron, let's go. So what do you think? Whoa, I, I love it. Green really suits you. If this thing is called the Golden Ball, then why am I dressed like a flower? <laughs> because this year's theme is spring. Wow, this place is really fancy, huh? Man, I am starving right now. Same. Dang, look at all the desserts. You see the cupcakes? Well, what are we waiting for? Come on! Oh, these desserts are so good. Hey, aren't those your favorite flowers? Tulips, right? This is the sign. Wait, like from your parents? Is that a note? Kayla, this is... Freeze. Both of you are coming with us. Hey, aren't those your favorite flowers? Tulips, right? This is the sign. Wait, like from your parents? Is that a note? Kayla, this is... Freeze. Both of you are coming with us. Get off of me! Kayla! Well, look who we have here. <sighs> Mom? Mrs. Stewart? Mom, what is going on? I'm getting us the treasure, honey. They're gonna bring back the lost pirate's treasure. <laughs> My parents found the treasure. And they're alive. Why, look, you changed your mark, didn't you? That's against the law. Now let's see that note. You give that back. Now what does this say, Delilah? Do you know what that means? No. She's definitely lying. Give her the truth serum. Jake? Mom, stop it. What does Delilah mean? It was the name of my old treehouse that my parents made for me in the woods. Interesting. And do you know where it is? Yes. Perfect. Okay, let her go. Kayla, you're going to be taking us all to the treehouse. Now let's go. It's up there. The treasure has to be in that treehouse. Jake, climb up there and look for the treasure. No. You won't see Kayla again until you do. Take her away. Jake! Kayla! Pick a language to speak until you meet your soulmate. English or Spanish? I mean, everyone I know speaks English, so... Surprise attack! ¿Qué te pasa? <laughs> Why are you speaking Spanish? Esto es su culpa. Oh, you must have been picking what language to speak today. Mamá, tenemos un problema. Honey, did you pick to speak Spanish until you kiss your soulmate? How did this happen? Well... Ella. It was an accident. I'm sorry. Aw, oh, it's okay, baby. Seriamente? Oh, stop. You'll be fine. Go to school. Don't worry, bestie. I speak Spanish. I can translate for you. Sí, que. Gracias. Hey, girly, I gotta do something. I'll be right back. Just wait here. Por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Sorry, girl. I don't speak Spanish.
Uh, por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Are you speaking Spanish, girly? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Hey, I couldn't help but hear you said your head was hurting. Sí, ¿puedes entenderme? Sí, hablo español. I can understand you. Follow me. You said you need your medication. Where's your backpack? I... Okay. ¿Te sientes mejor? Did the medication help? Sí, gracias. So, you can't speak English at all right now? And you won't be able to until you kiss your soulmate? You never know, maybe you and I are soulmates. <laughs> I'm just saying, maybe we should try to... Well, that was nice. Sorry if I'm being awkward. No, it's okay. No way, you just spoke English. You and I must be soulmates. soulmates. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys. Oh, okay! Oh, yeah, bye. we'll be right here. So, um... How did you meet Sarah? From school. You? Work. Yeah. So it's, uh... Some weather we're having, huh? Yeah. Um, some weather. It's, I think it's gonna rain, though. No. Mm. Did you want something to drink? Oh, I I already have one, so yeah, I'm good. But you can you can go get one if you want. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'll just go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I seriously just don't like her. Like, who does she think she is? She thinks she's better than me, and she's right behind me, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> See anything? <laughs> see anything? No, don't see anything here. <gasps> so I have to get past the firewall. And we're in. Oh, that's where you're going, nerd. Hey! This is so where were you two? At the movies. At the movies? What we meant to say was, we went to the mall, and then we went to the movie. She's really good! <laughs> you know, you're wearing sweatpants. It's my thing. So? So that's against the rules, and you can't sit with us. Whatever. Those rules aren't real. They were real that day I wore a vest. <laughs> Anything I touch turns to money, or any doll I touch comes to life. I'm too little to have money, and I don't have any friends in foster care, so I pick this one. I pick this Barbie to come to life. Whoa. Hi. I'm Come Alive Barbie. Are you going to be my friend? Of course. I can be anything you want me to be. You can brush my hair and take me anywhere. Cool. You can also customize me using this remote. I want to give you brown eyes like me. Oh, Claire, who are you talking to? Uh-oh, who's that? That's another foster girl that lives here, and she's really mean to dolls. We have to hide you. Come on. Claire, who are you talking to? Nobody. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. What the? Barbie, I told you to hide. Sorry, Claire. I just love making new friends. Does this control her? Hey, give that back. Ugh, just let me see it. Stop, you're going to break her. Ugh, you're so annoying. This is why no one wants to adopt you. I don't want your dumb remote anyways. You killed her. <laughs> Have fun with your dead Barbie. Barbie, please wake up. Hola. Soy Barbie. ¿Cómo estás? Uh-oh, I think she reset you onto Spanish mode. Eres mi mejor amiga. Barbie, I can't understand you. What am I gonna do? Barbie, I can use my powers to bring Ken to life to help us. I hope you know how to bring Barbie off of Spanish mode. Hey, Barbie. Hola, Ken. Why is she speaking Spanish? That's why I brought you here, Ken. I don't know how to make her speak English. Can I see her remote? Sure. That should do. Hey, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Want to go for a drive? Sure, Ken. Activate the Barbie car. We cannot tell anyone that you're dolls. What do we say if they ask us? Tell them that, that you're my parents. Okay. Shh, we have to be really quiet so we can sneak out of here. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire. Claire! How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire! Claire. How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted. 
That's right, and one of her mother's many jobs is being a police officer. So if you don't leave right now, we're going to have you arrested. No, no, sorry, forget about the money. Bye! Claire. Are you okay? My arm got a little cut. Press the top button on the remote. Okay. Dr. Barbie is here to help. You're so strong, Claire. You should be feeling much better now. Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Claire, we... I understand if you don't want to because I know I'm not that great. What? Why would you think that? Because I'm not as smart or as cute as the other kids. I think that's why nobody wants to adopt me. Oh, Claire. Don't think like that. You're so smart. And you're super cute. Do you really think so? Claire, you can do anything you put your mind to. And anyone who tells you otherwise doesn't know what they're talking about. We would be honored to be your parents because you're such a good girl. Right, Ken? That's right, Barbie. Really? Yeah. Being a dad sounds fun. Guys, I forgot I had this in my pocket. My puppy. Since we're a family now, do we want to have a pet? Absolutely. Aww. Aww. This is going to be so much fun. I'll start looking for Barbie houses for us to live in. I'm so happy for us. We're going to be a great family. Yeah. Barbie and Ken, finally together at last. Ugh. Ow, my head. Barbie? Ken, what's wrong? Five mil or a lamp? Well, I'm like really afraid of the dark, so I gotta have a lamp. <sighs> this isn't a lamp. It doesn't even have like a light bulb. Did you get your birthday gift yet? Yeah, I picked a lamp, but I got scammed. It doesn't even light up or anything. That's a genie lamp. What? Have you tried rubbing it? Um, no, that's weird. You dumb dumb, you gotta rub it to activate your wishes. Haven't you seen Aladdin? Oh my god, wait, I remember that movie. You're right. So, do I just rub it like this? Yeah, I think so. Nothing's happening. Open the lamp. Agree! Congrats. You got three wishes. Hi, can I just get, um, what's a mega pint? That's equivalent to 20 of these coffee cups. Okay, guess I'll be getting that then. Stop that. Sorry. I'm a little hyper this morning. I had a lot of coffee. Just don't fold the money. That reminds me of a song. My money don't jiggle jiggle. Fold. There's no singing in my classroom. Detention. No, please. That's going to mess up my perfect record for college, and I've been saving up for so long. You could pay me 50 diamonds to get out of it. Of course. Help! My dog stepped on a bee! Your dog looks fine to me. He's not! I need 20,000 diamonds to take him to the vet! I'm sorry, but I'm trying to save up for college. Please. <sighs> Alright, fine, but you owe me. Everyone, pay up for college. Wait, that's today? Yep, it's 40,000 diamonds to get in. I don't have enough. <laughs> but I do. Want to go to a concert tonight? Uh, yes. <laughs> Your stepmom gonna let you? Yeah, totally. Absolutely not. But, but nothing. You owe us too many favors. Look, if I complete all of the favors, then can I go? I suppose that's fair. I agree. She needs to change that number. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> She's so innocent. You're never gonna make it. This is useless. I've already done so many chores, and I still have 40 favors left. Excuse me, dear. What if I told you I could get rid of all your favors? You just have to hold this for me. Seriously? Deal. Excellent. Thank you so much. <laughs> Ella, you finished all your favors. How? Ah, mother! Huh. Ready for the concert? Where did you get that? Why? Because that gem is dangerous. If you touch it, you... Come on, make me something good. A penguin and a backpack? No freaking way. I love this. I got a magic wallet that gives me money. That is so cool. I know, right? What'd you get? I got a penguin backpack, but I don't really know what it does yet. I'm going to go get some food. See you. Okay, bye. 
Man, I really wish I had some water. Whoa, is it just me or did this thing get heavier? No way, there is like a bunch of waters in here. This backpack must grant wishes. Okay, let's just test this again. I wish for $100 in 20s. This is amazing. I'm home. I wish for some headphones. Hey sis, what's this? Aren't you kind of old to have a stuffed animal backpack? Give it back. Wait a minute, what's inside of here? Hey, how'd you get all this money? Did you steal this money? No, it was my magic gift. It grants me wishes. Yeah, right. Prove it. All right. I wish for a necklace. Nothing happened. I must have to be holding on to it for it to work. Nice try. I know you're stealing money. You probably think you're so cool, but you're not. Ugh. Oh, yeah? How about now, Benson? That's it. Where are you? I wish to be at a friend's house. I really hope you can do that. <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Oh, hey, Chad! Uh, how, how'd you get in here? Uh, your back door was open. Sweet! I was wondering if you wanted to come to prom with me. Yeah! I gotta check on something. Be right back. Okay. He asked me to prom, but I don't even have a dress. Wait. I wish for a red dress that's kind of fitted, but not too fitted. You know what I mean, Penguin. Just work your magic. Oh my gosh, yes! This is perfect! I should also wish for some accessories and- Hey, there's some cops in the front of my house and they say they're looking for you. Can you draw me a- No, I have been drawing you stuff all day. Oh, come on. All I need is scotch tape. Just because I have powers doesn't mean you can take advantage of me. Mom, Lindsay won't use her powers for Lindsay, me. Lindsay, don't be selfish. Fine, this is so unfair. Here, are you happy now? Thank you. Hey. Hi. Do you think you can draw me some flowers for a special somebody? Yeah, sure. All done. Um, here you go. Thanks. Giving these to Lauren. Oh. Aw, oh, Derek, you shouldn't have. Well, well, if it isn't the little artist. <laughs> Draw me some water. Now. Yeah, okay. Aw, thank you. I don't like it. Hey, you got my whiteboard and everything wet. Whoops. <laughs> Just buy a new one. This is the only one that works with my magic. <gasps> Mom? I need my inhaler, but I can't find it. <laughs> Draw me my inhaler. It's not working. <laughs> it's not working. Get help. <laughs> Mom. How is she doing today, doctor? A little bit better. But her medication she needs is taking a week to come. I have to get this marker working. It's higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. Mm. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But... Run, now! Hey, shoo! Get out of here! Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vines. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were you? I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, Princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. I guess the likeness score works on animals, too. Now that I'm at a hundred percent, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him. Mom, look, I can get a teddy bear or a paintbrush. I think I'm gonna go with teddy bear. <gasps> no, pick the paintbrush. But I said pick it. Okay. My paintbrush came in. Oh, thank goodness. There, that's for you. Now paint money. Money? Why money? Honey, just paint it. Okay. Okay, I'm done, but I don't understand why- Shh! Look! 
Your paintbrush is magic. No way. So you're telling me that everything I paint will come to life? Yes, the paintbrush only works for you. Well, I want to paint a puppy. Honey, no. Don't be selfish. You need to think of others before yourself, and there's lots of things that I need. Okay, here's your gold crown. Oh, it's perfect. Mom, can you please make me some food? All this painting is making me really hungry. Why, of course. But don't draw anything while I'm cooking. I'm going to paint something she would never let me have. My own boyfriend. Honey, dinners. Let me see that. Now that I reached 100%, that has to be my soulmate. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, hello, my dear. I hope I didn't scare you. Actually, I'm not supposed to have strangers. But wait, I'm here to give you your soulmate. In that case, come inside. I brought this for you. An apple? Yes, you must be hungry. I don't like apples. But dear, I sense you're very lonely ever since your parents passed away. How do you know that? Because I'm magic. Isn't that how you feel? Yes, I, I've been so lonely. This is why I'm here, to help you, dear. One bite of this apple will make your soulmate appear. Do you promise? Cross my heart. You'll never be lonely again. Isn't it just delicious? You're so gullible. <laughs> what did you paint? Nothing. I was just scribbling. Really? Then let me see it. No, wait. What is this? This is going in the garbage. Please, he wasn't done yet. He? Were you trying to draw a boyfriend? No. Give me that. No, this is my magic paintbrush. You can't just... Don't tell me what I can't do. I'm confiscating all of your paint stuff until tomorrow. Sorry, Mom, but I'm finishing this. The last thing I need is his eye color. I think this blue will look nice. He's done. Did you learn your lesson? Yeah, I did. Good. Here's your painting supplies back. Today, there is a lot I need you to paint for me. I finished your purple hair clips. Thank you, honey. Can I be done now? Hmm. I know you're not that tired. Well, it has been two hours, so okay, you rest. Mom, five more minutes. I'm not your mom. I'm your boyfriend. Princess, we're home. No, this is my fault, Dad. Son, it is. I should have never left her alone. You'll be a queen in heaven. Goodbye, son. Soulmate found. Zachary? Princess, you're... You're alive. True love's kiss. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what the queen did. This has gone too far, my dear. You must take back your kingdom. You're right. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? Princess Snow is the most liked. That's impossible. She's dead. Think again. Stepmother, you're under arrest. Guards, take her away. Get off of me! I'll be taking this. No! That belongs to me! That crown belongs to Snow now, and I gotta say, it really suits her. I'm your boyfriend. You look exactly like how I pictured you. Down to the hair color and everything. I can't believe this. I didn't even do the best job painting you, but you seem to have come out. Who is this? That's the delivery man. Delivery man? I didn't order anything. Excuse me, I'm her boyfriend. What? You disobeyed me. Mom, I have been painting so much stuff for you, and all I ask for is just one boyfriend, please. Do you have my hair clips? Yeah, they're right here. What are you doing? Testing a theory. If I rip his painting, he disappears. Look, I found it. Stop! <sighs> Mom, let go, please. You're hurting him. Oh, that's the point. No! It's okay. Hey, catch! Don't give that to her! What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Getting you out of my life. You can't do that! Where did she go? I, uh, painted her on a tropical island, but don't worry. I'll make sure she's well taken care of. Get adopted by a race car driver or a billionaire? I'd be kind of scared something would happen to the race car driver, so I'm gonna go with billionaire. Who'd you pick to get adopted by? Oh, I chose a billionaire. You got that as an option? My choices were a garbage man or a teacher. That is so not fair. Whoever it is is gonna think she's weird anyways. She'll be brought back. This is the man who's going to adopt you. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. First things first, you're going to need some of these. What are these for? A lot of paparazzi follow Mr. Knight. I'm his assistant. Hi, I suggest you put those on now. Mr. Knight, is this your new daughter? This way, darling. 
Your house is really nice, sir. Oh, thank you. What's that? This is a list of things that I wanted to do with my new parents. Are you married? Actually, sorry, kid. No, I'm not married. That's okay. I'll just adjust some things. I don't know about this. People are loving that you adopted her, and as soon as they write enough good articles, we'll bring her back to the adoption center. Good morning. You look sad. Well, it's just that I can't find any of the clothes that I brought with me. Oh, darling, that's because I threw them away. What? Why would you... They were hideous. We can't have you wearing orphan clothes. But... Hush. Follow me. Oh, this is much better. But the dress is a little bit short. You're sixteen, not six. Now hand that thing over. No. What's going on in here? Mr. Knight, your assistant. She's trying to take away my plush. Susan? She needs to act her age. Please don't let her, Mr. Knight. This is really special to me. She's too old for it. It has to go. <gasps> no. Don't be so dramatic, dear. You'll be fine. Smile, Madeline. We're going to do a photo shoot. Smile bigger. Stop the cameras. That's enough pictures. Here, Madeline. Look what I found. How about we do something on your list today? I saw you wrote down Disneyland. Want to do that? Okay. It's beautiful, isn't it? Psst, kid, here. Thank you. Madeline, we need to talk. Mr. Knight doesn't have time to be taking you places. He said that he had fun spending time with me, and that I can keep this. Oh, is that so? Don't make me send you back to that- Susan, I need your help. Coming, sir. What's next on the list today, kid? Are you sure you have time? Yeah, I need a little break from work anyways. Well, I always wanted to go to a science museum. All right, science museum it is. Susan, prepare a driver for us, please. Of course. Have a good time? Yes, it was so much fun. <laughs> it really was. I'm sorry if I'm too much of a distraction for you. Kid, you're not a distraction. In fact, I think you're exactly what I needed in my life. Okay, you rest now, and I'll see you in the morning. Good night. Sir, the paparazzi got you at the science museum today, and so many articles have been written. I don't care about the articles anymore. What? Shh. I'm not going to use a kid to get me more publicity. The plan's off. But, sir, guess I'll just have to get rid of you myself. And I know just what to do. I found someone from your real family. You did? Yes, dear, your Uncle Nick. I don't remember an Uncle Nick. He'll explain everything, darling. He's here. So you're her mom's brother? Yeah. How did you find me? You're all over the news. I know you probably don't recognize me. Your mom didn't really talk about me much. But I'd like to adopt you. I'm happy here with Mr. Knight. Madeline, don't be rude. At least give him a chance. I don't want to push anything, so how about you live with me for a week, and if you don't like it, I'll bring you right back here. Uh, okay. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Oh, perfect. You call me on this phone if you need anything, okay? I will. Thank you. Of course. Come here, kid. I bought you some candy. Susan tells me it's your favorite. Thanks. We'll be at my place soon. Is it good? Why do you have that stuffed animal? Oh, uh, one of my best friends from foster care gave it to me. Taste everything my boyfriend eats, or feel every time he gets hurt. I'm kind of a picky eater, so I'd rather know when he's getting hurt. Power activated. Should I tell him that I have this power now? Nah, that's kind of weird. What? What's weird, babe? Nothing. Uh, all right. Well, I'm headed to the store. Okay, be safe. Ow, what the heck? What did he do to his hand? You kind of took a while. Yeah, traffic. I'm sorry, babe. Why is your fist all red? Oh, that. Yeah, I scraped myself at Home Depot today, picking up some plywood. <laughs> I gotta go into work. What? I know it's a weekend, but they need me. Can't you just cancel? <sighs> Not this time, babe. I'm sorry. I'll be back. All right, be safe. You know, I never really found out where he actually works. I think that he just got... You don't look so good. Are you feeling okay? No, not really. Hey, it's me. The candy worked. She's half out of it now. Excellent. All right, time to come inside. Come on. Finally, I can take this from her. So what do we do with him now? Well, she's already got Mr. Knight all the publicity he needs, so she's no longer of use to me. Susan, what's going on? Oh, Madeline, isn't it obvious? I'm getting you away from this tonight. He's mine. Mr. Knight is going to find me. He's not going to look for you, because Susan's been telling him that you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, darling, but I need to be the focus of Mr. Knight's life, not you.
<sighs> you know, I never really found out where he actually works. I think that he just got shot. Hey, it's me again. I'm really worried about you. Please, just call me back. Oh my god, babe, you're back. Are you okay? Yeah. Wait, why are you asking me that? Well, I've just been really worried about you because you haven't answered any of my calls and I had this feeling that you- I'm fine, babe. Really. I just need a rest, please. We've been together for a year and I don't even know what his job is. I'm going to march right up there and ask him what- Ow! Did he just get hit in the head? Ah, oh, what is going on? I told you guys I quit. Babe. Is that guy- Don't worry, baby. He's just, uh, sleeping. There's something I have to tell you. I- I work for the Mafia. The what? I know, I know. It's bad. But today I quit and I promise- oh. Ow! Wait, why'd you say ow? Well, there's, uh, something that I need to tell you, too. Build my own pet or build my own soulmate? I'm pretty single right now, so I think I'm gonna go with soulmate. Pick a color. I like them both, but I am a sucker for blue eyes. Pick a hug. I mean, I want him to be tall, but not, like, too tall. Six foot is good. Pick his figure. Not that that's important, but, you know, a little muscle never hurt anyone. Okay, now this one is confusing me. Toxic or supportive? Yeah, I really want my man to be toxic. Come on. Creating your soulmate now. Okay, I am so nervous. Please stand by your soulmate is processing. All right. I have been waiting here for like two hours. What is the hold up? Unexpected error. Your soulmate has been delivered. Okay, that was uh, really weird. Okay, no big deal. Your soulmate is at that door, so just be cool, be confident. Here we go. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Everything's fine, sir. I want to talk to her. Ah, uh, sorry, she just fell asleep. Thanks to this brat, Mr. Knight is getting suspicious. You're not going to get away with this. Mr. Knight is going to find me. <gasps> it's him. Stay calm. I will handle it. So, I can assure you, everything is fine. Help! Wait, don't open that! Madeline? I'm sorry, sir, but you're supposed to be in love with me, not her! You're my assistant! But I wanted to be more than that! You're insane. Both of you, get back. Susan and your fake uncle have both been arrested. I thought I'd never see you again. I am so sorry this happened, Madeline. But I promise, as your father, I'll protect you from now on. Father? So, you still want to adopt me? Aw, oh, kid, of course. I mean, after all, we've got that list to finish, right? And look what I found. I love you, Dad. Madeline, I... I love you, too. Let's see your mark. Purple? Purple equals famous. You're five and you still can't read. It says famous. Well, does that mean that I'm gonna be famous? You famous? Oh, no, honey. These marks are just for fun. But, um, you should cover yours up. Three, two, one. Happy New Year! Let's reveal our marks. Okay, you go first. Okay. You got red. Ah, uh, phew. All right, my turn. Oh, shit. What? Just look at this mirror. <sighs> you got purple. I don't think this is a good idea. Shh, stay still. Yeah, that's the best I can do. Look, who said being gifted is a bad thing? I mean, do we really need to change my mark? Yes, I heard rumors about what might happen to the gifted people, and it's really not good. This just in, all the purple marks will be taken in by the government for experimentation, as they could be a potential threat to normals and therefore need to be examined by professionals. Honey, let's go, we're late. W where are we going? Lizzie, it's time for the mark check. That's today? Yes, let's go. Let's see your mark. It's smeared. Uh, yeah, it just appeared like that. Mm-hmm. We have a code 52. What's a code 52? No questions. Come with me. Just as I thought. You should have done a better job with the makeup. Well, actually, my friend did it. Right. Blame it all on your friend. But she did. Don't get her angry. We don't know what she's capable of. Fine. Prepare the scanner. Scanner? Quiet. No talking, please. Turn your head to the side and stay still. Scanning. Level 10. Oh my gosh. What does that mean? She must be the one. It can't be. Quick, someone get her a room and get her labeled now. What is going on and why is there a 10 on my neck? It's the danger level of your powers. Powers? 
What do you mean by powers? Everyone with a purple mark has been gifted with powers. You have them too. I do? Mm -hmm. Now prepare her for testing. Welcome to the testing room. We will now determine what power you have. There's been a mistake. I don't have powers. Of course you do. They just haven't been activated. Well, how does that happen? We found that it happens during a time of distress. Okay, now that's on. Let's try mind reading. This is ridiculous. Just say what number you think I'm thinking of. I don't know. Uh, two. Wrong. Ow! So sorry, but this is part of the process. Ten. No, wrong again.